welcome back. I want to share a resource with you guys. So in, in the previous several videos, I have offered to send you some files if you want them, just to email me. And it occurred to me that I really don't have to have you email me. I've, I can share these same files the same way I've been sharing the Rock of Assure Foundation and, and a few other PDFs that I've made available to you through this uh, this Proton Proton drive I have. And of course I got plenty of storage on it so instead of having you guys email me for stuff I could just make it available there. But I've got quite a bit in my library. Like I've got a, a folder on my computer that's my library and it's where I store like all my the books I use in my videos and that sort of thing. And I figure, you know what, if I'm going to start sharing some of these, I might as well just go through and see everything that's worthy of being shared. And if, if you guys want a copy of it, I can make it available to you. So that's what I've done. And I created this PDF. There will be a link in the description of the video so you can download the, this PDF. And once you download this PDF, it's got a link to my YouTube channel, a link to my email address. <clears throat> And it's also got a link in it to where if I ever update this document, you can download the update from this link here. But also, all the books that I have in my library that I thought might be a benefit to some of you guys, I've put links in the document. Um, I could not put a hyperlink in the document for some reason. Like I... When I created this document on um, Apple Pages, it the links worked. And when I exported this to a PDF, the links would not work. So unfortunately, I couldn't put links in. But like, if you wanted to download Eusebius Proof of the Gospel, you can just you can highlight this, copy and paste it into your browser, and you can download it. Um, you know, it's not. I had to remove all the hyperlinks because the hyperlinks wouldn't work. Um, but you can, like the Oralinda Codex, it's in here. You can just copy that, paste it into your browser, and you can download the PDF and have a copy of it. Um, I've bolded the stuff that I think is more important, like the Panarian. I think it's a very important work if you're interested in understanding what the Ebionites believed or any of the early Jewish Christians. Um, in fact, there's also information in there about other groups like the Simonians, the people who followed Simon Magus. Um, Epiphanius talks about them in, in this document. So there's a lot of there's information on different groups that were actual heretics that you could download if and, and you can read it if you want to. Um, there's a link, of course, to the Rocket Sure, sure Foundation. There's Josephus complete works. Here's the sources for the Gospel of the Hebrews that I've shown on my channel that you guys can, uh, if you, if you have questions about the information in the reconstructed Gospel of the Hebrews in the Rock of Assure Foundation, you can download this file here, and it gives you all the sources for that information. Um, you know this book, Kitab Al Magal. That's a a book of another book of the Clementine literature. I don't consider it to be really as trustworthy as the recognitions and and homilies, but um, but it's it's interesting to read. It, um, it it talks about the whole primal atom theology and stuff in it. So if you if you haven't read that before and you want to get a copy of it, you can download it here. So everything on here. Uh, th this is not stuff that you would have to buy normally. Like this, a lot of these are older books that are, um, you know, in the public domain at this point. Um, if something is not available for free online, I didn't include it. So, like if if um, if there's an author selling his book and you can purchase the book online, I you know I, I didn't include it. Everything included in here is available somewhere for free online already. Otherwise, you know, 
I wouldn't include it. So like, um, who is Esau Edom by Charles Weissman? You can find that very easily free online. I just included it in here to make it easier for you. Um, you know, this is a really important book <clears throat> to read. It's free online and other places, so I included it free here. There's uh, this is another important book for the whole who is Esau Edom thing. Um, uh, the Covenant of Salt. I've talked about that book before on my channel. Uh, it's a terrific book to read. Who Wrote the Bible? Richard Elliott Freeman. Discussed that numerous times. Um, so, uh, you know, there's a lot of information here. The Syriac Recognitions and Homilies. This one is actually, the author is sharing it for free on academia.org. And since he's sharing it for free, then I, I included it. Um, but he was selling this on Amazon also. Um, but yeah, it's just a lot of interesting books. Not all of it directly ties into religious studies, like this History of the American Indians by James Adair. This is a book that was written in the 17, late 1700s, early 1800s, that um, Mr. Adair was a, a man that interacted quite extensively with Native Americans, and he discusses what their society was like back then like it's an interesting book um but yeah so not everything is directly related to the bible um most of it is we got dead sea scrolls um we got uh Arrhenius against heresies the first book of adam and eve uh, but some of this is just history or talks about the edomites shenanigans and um you know that sort of thing but it's, it's free it's a resource for you to use. Um, just you know, keep in mind you're going to have to you're going to have to copy these links and paste them into your browser because I couldn't get hyperlinks to work in this document for some reason. Um, but yeah, that's it. There'll be a link in the description to download to download this PDF, and then once you have this PDF, you can get access to all of these others through these links. So it's yours free if you want it. If you have a document that you think should be shared and you want to make that available email it to me my email is up here just send me an email i'll look at it if i agree that i think it's something that might benefit people then i'll i'll add it to the list and then i don't know if, if several months go by and you want to see if there's anything new added to the list just go to this link here and you'll download a new copy of this this document and if there's any new links down here, they'll be they'll be down there. So you can uh, maybe see if there's new documents. If you ever try to download one of these and the link doesn't work, um, the first thing I would recommend is trying, uh, again, that link there to download a fresh copy of it. Once it comes up. So here's the fresh copy you can download. And if the links still don't work, then... Um, Send me an email. And let me know if the link isn't working. The link isn't working, and I'll I'll get it updated. Um, but yeah, so if you have something you want to add to the library, shoot me an, an email with the PDF. And um, if you have a better version of one of these PDFs, like this book, uh, Who Wrote the Bible? This PDF is not the best. It's a scanned copy of the book. Maybe you yourself have a really good copy of it and you want to send that to me and I'll replace this version of who wrote the Bible with the, the better one. Um, some of these others may be poor quality PDFs too. Um, they're all legible, but if you have a better version of one of these, then send it to me. And, uh, and maybe we can start sharing some of these resources because probably... 90% of the material I use on my channel, it comes from one of these documents. And so, you know, we we as a people, we don't tend to really want to read much anymore. Everybody wants to watch watch videos or watch, you know, television or whatever. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm one of those people I like to read. I like to, if I see someone in a video talking about a particular subject and they refer to some some book that they got the information from, I'll get a copy of the book and I'll look it up for myself just to confirm it says what they say. <clears throat> um, so, 
you really, if you were to take some of these files and 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 study them for yourself, read them for yourself, um, you know, like the Rock of a Sure Foundation, it's got all the the primary documents that I use, like the Nazarene Acts and the Sermons of Peter and the Didache and all these primary documents that I use are in there. Like you could just get that book and, and ninety percent of the information from my channel you don't even need to watch my videos because you'll have it. You'll have the information. And then the stuff that's not in the Rock of Assure Foundation is somewhere in here. Like everything, like these are all the books that I refer to on my channel. There there may be a couple of exceptions of books that I didn't include here, but for the most part, you know, all the information's here and it's available to you. So you don't even have to watch my videos and get the information through me. You can go straight to the source and and study these sources out yourself if you'd like so anyway like i said free for you free resource if you've got anything that you think should be included in this and you've got a copy of it send me a copy and i'll i'll add it to the list and and that's uh that's about it so hope you're having a good shabbat I'll talk to you later